saw me standing alone without a dream in my heart without a love of my own An American Werewolf in London is such a great horror movie and cult classic that I would say is in many people's horror top 30. It's actually in my top 10. I love the movie. It's a film that manages to expertly mix horror and humour along with story, character and of course in 1981 groundbreaking special effects from Rick Baker which he received the inaugural Academy Award for. I wanted to take a look at the filming locations 35 years later so I did. Well in this video part 1 I travel to the Black Mountains and Crickadarm which are in Wales. In part 2 I will be visiting in London for the remainder of the locations that will be later on this year. The opening scenes were filmed in the Black Mountains on the north east side near Hay Bluff. Of course in the film the setting was the Yorkshire Moors. The way I found the location was to head to Hay on Wye and take a southerly heading from there like this. Of course there are other roads from the east and the south to get there but word of warning the roads are very narrow, only enough room for one vehicle and the likelihood is that you will meet other cars and tractors. There are some passing points but be prepared to reverse a good distance. And this is the exact spot where Jack and David were dropped off. Also, as you will see here, there aren't any roadside barriers, so be careful. Okay, here I am on the Yorkshire Moors. Well, it's not really. But in American Way for London, this was the Yorkshire Moors, but it's actually the Black Mountains in well, near Hereford. So, let's take a look. So, the road just there in front of me, that's where we get the opening scene, we get lots of cutaways of the mountains and different things at the beginning of the film. As you can see, lots of sheep. Apart from the birds, it's very, very quiet and the odd sheep noise as well. So there we go, that's where the film started after the cutaways just there so the transit came along this road and turned in there the boys got out and started to walk here then exited the frame so we had a this sort of shot like a crane or a, a big jib came down And the boys, Jack and David, climbed out the truck just here. And of course, he said stick to the road. So the transit just went in there. We saw a couple of shots, they were talking, and then it sort of cut back to this angle. I think that mountain was in the background just there, like that. Just uh, need to adjust the stabiliser a bit, that one. And then we walked a little bit with them, sort of here. And then and then it cut. is an amazing place to be honest. It's 
there's quite a few cars, quite a few people coming up here, lots of cyclists. But the view across there, you can't see it because there's haze. Mist haze. But you, you can't quite see the view that I can see. I'm not sure if I adjust the exposure, you might be able to see it a little bit better. No. There you go. The next location where the boys reach the slaughtered lamb in East Proctor is actually Crickadon, a 30 minute drive from the Black Mountains location to the northwest. The Angel of Death statue was put in the middle of the road and I believe the phone box was covered up. So, this is where Dr. Hirsch would have come in. Drive the car around, like so. And if we noticed, we can still see I don't know what it is, it's like a water fountain or something into the brickwork there, right in front, that's still there. Then he came round and he parked right about here. Just there. Now, if we look, this house here is the slaughtered lamb. That was the outside of the house, it's just somebody's house now. Uh, but that's where he went in. That's the road where David and Jack walked up at the beginning. And they sort of stopped around here and then looked at the sign which was put on the side of the building as a prop for the slaughtered lamb. Again, this is where Dr. Hirsch came into the graveyard and he had his conversation about here in the rain it's all pretty much the same and he walked in came in through the gate just there So this is Crack, Crackadon, how it is today, and it was obviously called East Proctor in the movie. So again, that's where the doctor was parked, just there, and that's the back of the church. So they would walk down the hill over the back of those houses and when they came out of the slaughtered lamb they sort of took this route and went down that road there and obviously the camera rose like this it didn't tilt like that <laughs> and then we saw the statue so I hope you enjoyed the video, in a few months I'll be visiting some of the locations from the living dead at the Manchester Morgue in the Peak District and around December time I'll complete part 2 of the London locations for American Wealth in London. Film, fill it out. <laughs>